What's new in Awaken OS version 1.7 official build based on Android 11 running on the Xiaomi Poco F1? Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And we have a new official build of Awaken OS version being 1.7 based on Android 11 available for the Xiaomi Poco F1. First change you will notice is that the security patch has been updated to May 2021. The kernel they are using is Silver Core version 8.9. Build is from Monday, May 17th. SE Linux, of course, is set as enforcing. Next up, a very important feature which they have added is app lock. So if you go into settings, security, make sure you have set up your pin, fingerprint or face and then you can go into app locker. You do have to re-enter your pin. And once you do that, you can lock the applications. And as you can see, calculator and calendar are locked and I just unlocked the calculator application. And you can also choose to lock app after instantly 15 seconds or screen off. So these are the customizations which you get with app lock. And yes, you do have IR face unlock baked in as well, another nifty feature which they have added is per app volume. So you can go into settings, awaken settings, themes. Here in scroll down, you should have the option of show app volume. Make sure that this toggle is enabled. Once you enable this, now let us say I go into YouTube, right? And let me try to play this video. Now, once I play this video, you will notice if I try to access my volume panel, here it is. And you have a new slider for YouTube itself. So this is my per app volume for YouTube. Similarly, let us say I pause this and now if I go into YouTube music, go into my library and try to play this track, right? And access the volume panel, bam, here it is. I now have the volume slider for YouTube music as well. So this again is a very important feature or pretty nifty one. Then they have also added smart cutoff. So if you go into settings, battery, bam, here it is. Smart cutoff. Using this, you can turn off your battery charging at a specific percentage and turn it on at a specific temperature. Sorry, I said percentage earlier, but it is based on a specific temperature. Those of you who are looking for a specific percentage, you can go into smart charging and here you can set the stop and start trigger level based on the percentage. Other than that, if you press and hold on the empty screen, go into styles and wallpapers. As you can see, we do have the new wallpapers from Earth Day and Women's Day and the May patch wallpapers in curated culture. But if you go into clock, they have added three new clocks. So they have added the IDE clock from project 404. Then they have also added the fluid clock and they have also added the clock from shapeshift os for your lock screen so those were the new features next thing we can check for is safety net so my device is not rooted right now i have only installed the latest version of magisk app which is version 23.0 to check for safety net and as you can see safety net is passing without any issues which means you should be able to use your banking apps as well in terms of youtube media playback everything works absolutely fine no jitters no lags picture in picture works of course for picture in picture to work you either need to have youtube premium or you need to be in a specific country in case you do not want to pay for YouTube premium. Next up, let us go to the photos application and try to edit a picture of my favorite football star to check whether we have the portrait light feature or not. So let us go back and try to edit it one more time. Wait for this loading bar to finish. And then if you're going to adjust portrait light, bam, here it is. Portrait light feature is present and it works without any issues next up let us check whether hey google is working or not so hey google works with the screen turned on let us turn the screen off hey google are you awake and as you can see hey google works with the screen turned off as well let me go ahead and use face unlock to unlock the device unlocked without any issues next up let us have a look at the app opening animations to see if you have any lags or any jitters in that regard and as you can see no lags and no jitters recents bam here it is everything is smooth in respect to the recents as well select works without any issues screenshot also works do note i am using 
the vanilla build of awaken os with next stock g apps on top next up let us have a look at our google feed and as you can see no jitters and no lags in the google feed either let us try switching between a few applications everything is pretty smooth no jitters no lags with respect to switching between the applications as well so again all in all another great build of awaken os for the poco f1 and of course install video links to features of the previous builds all those videos can be found in the description of this video and that will do it for this one hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you